Welcome to Veterans Forum, a program by veterans, about veterans, for veterans and their families. I'm your co-host Bob West with Ray Chattery and Jerry Devlin. Our goal is to provide important information on legislation, benefits, support, and activities for you and your family by interviewing leaders in our community. Jerry, who do we have with us today? We're really lucky tonight, uh, Bob, to have with us uh, Laura Vucci, who's Director of Marketing at Charlotte Hall Veterans Home. Charlotte Hall really is one of the great institutions of its kind in the United States, but unfortunately, it's not as well known as it might be. So we're here to, to give to our audience some really uh, on-the-spot views from, from Laura, who's been Director of Marketing for six years. Uh, she's a native of Prince George's County who grew up in Waldorf, so she's very familiar with the local scene. And before we came on the air, she was kind enough to show us pictures of her new daughter, Samantha. So we're really honored to have uh, Laura with us, who's a very able and eloquent spokeswoman for Charlotte Hall. Laura? Thank you. Thank you so much for having me here. It's imperative to spread the word throughout the state of Maryland. Charlotte Hall Veterans Home is actually the only long-term care and assisted living facility within the entire state of Maryland. We accept veterans from Cumberland all the way to Ocean City, up to Cecil County, all the way down to Nanjimoy. So we really take a broad spectrum of the, and gather veterans from the entire state of Maryland. I, I spend most of my days out in the community visiting hospitals, senior centers, departments of aging, VFWs, American Legions, bingo halls, churches, everywhere seniors are to create community awareness and let people in the community know that there's a place there for veterans who are over 62 and may need long-term care or assisted living. It really is the Cadillac of all nursing homes, as one of our veterans actually said in a radio spot that he did for us. He called Charlotte Hall Veterans Home the Cadillac of Veterans Home, and I think that really speaks volumes. We actually have 400, um, are able to take 462 veterans, and today we have 403. I mentioned we have assisted living and a nursing home. But first, I'd like to go to a clip that I've brought with me today that explains all of the different services that we offer, and then we can talk a little bit more about the details of those services. Well, that's great. Let's go to the clip. Serving those who serve. Charlotte Hall Veterans Home is Maryland's only skilled nursing and assisted living facility exclusively serving the needs of Maryland veterans and their eligible spouses. Charlotte Hall Veterans Home is an affordable alternative to private nursing care. A program of the Maryland Department of Veterans Affairs Charlotte Hall opened in 1985, has 504 beds, and is located on 126 acres just outside the nation's capital in historic St. Mary's County. Charlotte Hall offers a specialized dementia care unit for those residents requiring the added safety provided by a secured unit. We offer a full range of on-site rehabilitation services, including speech therapy, physical therapy, and occupational therapy. With one of the largest rehab gyms in the area and state-of-the-art equipment, our staff strives to help residents achieve their optimum level of function and return to an independent life as quickly as possible. To ensure our residents receive top quality medical care, Charlotte Hall has on staff attending physicians for the skilled nursing unit and the assisted living unit, each of whom make rounds weekly. In addition to our physicians, we also have physicians assistants and nurse practitioners on site Monday through Saturday. This medical staff is supervised by two medical directors who are certified by the American Medical Directors Association. 
In addition to long-term and primary medical care, Charlotte Hall makes available on-site medical services such as dental, psychiatry, and podiatry services. Transportation to and from the Veterans Administration Medical Center in Washington is provided free of charge for our residents. To provide the best quality nursing care for our residents, Charlotte Hall Veterans Home is staffed with registered nurses, licensed practical nurses, geriatric and certified nursing assistants, and certified medicine aides and technicians who carry out the orders of our physicians. These skilled and caring individuals are here 24 hours a day to make life at Charlotte Hall enjoyable and dignified. Social and fitness activities are designed to interest and stimulate all the residents at Charlotte Hall Veterans Home. Our residents are offered many opportunities to participate in both in-house activities and activities outside of the facility. Our devoted volunteer program provides many additional services and entertainment events for our residents. We are proud of the wide range of activities that can be found occurring at any given moment at Charlotte Hall. The newly renovated Barber and Beauty Shop truly gives residents a feeling of being pampered. The women enjoy their own side of the salon with a spa-like experience, while the men can stop in for a quick buzz and continue on their way. We have a licensed barber beautician in the facility several days a week to keep our residents looking and feeling good about themselves. Good nutrition is a key to healthy living. Our registered dietitians work closely with the residents and their families to assure proper diet. Meals served in two spacious dining rooms feature excellent selections designed to meet individual needs. Computers are provided throughout the facility for resident use. Volunteers donate their time to the very active computer club and to maintaining the computers in the computer lab. Residents have access to the internet and training is provided for those who have no experience with computers or the internet. Our residents are encouraged to make their rooms their own by decorating with their own personal touch. Many furnishings are provided for them, as well as receiving local telephone service, cable TV, internet access, housekeeping and laundry services. All nursing home beds at Charlotte Hall Veterans Home are Medicare Medicaid certified. Charlotte Hall also accepts private payment made by the resident and payment by some third-party medical insurances. The cost of resident care includes room and board, as well as laundry and housekeeping services. The cost to the resident is based upon the level of care they require. The amount assisted living residents pay is based upon each individual's monthly income. Charlotte Hall receives a per diem subsidy from the U.S. Department of Veterans Affairs that is applied toward the cost of veterans care and the State of Maryland provides an additional subsidy for veteran assisted living residents. Non-veteran spouse residents, however, are not eligible for state or VA subsidies. 